captains how keen they are to get out and play this game they know quick game is a good game well we've had three hours of rain and you mentioned Roshan how good the ground stuff has been here they've been able to cover the pitch secure the surface the pitch looks in very good condition yes there's a bit of dew there's a little bit of that spillover from the rain but we're having cricket and I think this will produce a very entertaining affair T20 cricket at its very best well as we know that Gladiators have already lost. Colombo Kings have won. So it will be very interesting if the Gladiators can overcome the Colombo Kings. The, the the points table will just open up. Yeah, they were off the boil in the previous game. So many mistakes were committed by called Gladiators. They're out there to routine themselves but it's not going to be easy Andre Russell oh he's a dynamite he can destroy any bowling attack in the world on his day Darren perfect setup perfect setup Pixila De Silva can hit the long ball Andre Russell Amit just said and up against very good bowling and I'm hoping that we'll have some sixers and fours raining from both sides to just try and make it so entertaining haven't you had enough of rain mate? Eh? <laughs> <laughs> Mohamed Amir always potent with the new ball so it's not going to be a walk in the park for this batting pair we count down to some royal entertainment. If you just join us, it's a five over a pair. The umpires, Rohita Kotachi and Pragit Rambukwella. Bit of seam movement. You will get that lateral movement. We spoke about the moisture the rain on the surface that one's killed hurried the batsman and Muhammad Amr really bending his back on that occasion that's what you expect from him employees experience Swing, good work by the wicket keeper. That's on Khan diving away. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Azam Khan, my goodness. What do you expect? Is Moin Khan's son? I know, but he's not Moin Khan. <laughs> Outstanding. I mean, look, we do respect, we do respect. Looking at his structure I and mean, the way he moved so quickly and got across it was brilliant tucked away Andrew Russell gets going gets going very early in this game oh he wrenched it didn't he he hit the ball with all the disdain and contempt in the world wow flatter than flat that six was flat batter it hardly went off the ground i mean it didn't go high it really didn't go high normally it would go it would be very high and over the ground it's so flat very nearly hit those boundary boards but good start very good start it's a six so already seven runs of two balls 
Well, although it's a five over affair, we hope that you've uh, gone on to your my 11 circle app and picked uh, your favorite players, your fantasy team. Andrew Russell should be in that squad. Giving himself room, another boundary. This is Russell's style of batting in T20s. Took a lot of pace on the ball. He was looking to bowl the change up. Just that Russell anticipated it very well. He just opened that front foot, waited for it. And then with that large gap, the length allowed him to play that shot. He sacked out the baller, didn't he? He knew it's going to be a slow delivery. He was ready for it. He was into the position quickly and executed it with authority. He's hot at the moment. It was a mile 11 circle champion shot, I'll tell you. It was such a champion shot because he read it well. The anticipation was good. He was waiting. Just have a look how he opens up a bit, Andrew Russell. That front foot just uh, goes a little bit wider. And he goes again. Bat on ball and it flies all the way for a six. Uh, if the batsman is given the license to go after the baller, you have to feel for the ballers. And especially when Andre Russell is batting. Well, Ace is coming, events casting shadows. They've got, what, 17 runs of four balls. By the looks of it, they might get more than 20 runs. So, well, we're going to be in for some real entertainment. And it's not Bam Bam stuff. He's watching the ball closely. He's getting into good positions very early. And that's why he's been able to execute some breathtaking strokes under Russell. Gentlemen, spare a thought for the bowlers. Ball getting wet flat wicket and then balling to Andre Russell you have to feel for the ballers two fielders outside the 30 yard circle a deep mid wicket a wide third man wide signal will have to reload nowhere to run nowhere to hide what was Amir complaining about? He knew it was a wide. <laughs> he, he, I, th I think he tried. He really tried to get in a dot ball. Maybe he was making a case for himself that since Andre Russell backed away from the stumps. But didn't impress the umpire at all. <laughs> Three boundaries for Andre Russell in this first over. Remember, it's a five overs per innings affair. Easy as you like. And it's another My 11 Circle Championship. Did we have rain? Did we ever have rain here? Well, the hierarchy, the management, they look a little bit shell-shocked. 26 runs in the first. That's in the air. 
and taken. First blood drawn. Melinda Should Sirivata. give him a lot of confidence. Melinda Sirivartana. The why he stayed. With, oh, that's a big hit. Another six. I thought the plan was to bowl wide. There's a man on the back foot point boundary. See, the mistake Asita did was going straight and on the pad with mid wicket open. So we speak about the experience, the learning curve. So these are these are good, good moments, good lessons that he could learn. I've also seen some he turned those good deliveries into bad ones. The scoring options. Another one. Flat batted it. And another my circle, my eleven circle. Champion boundary. This cricket suits you guys, the West suits you guys so well. Shorter the game is, you guys just love it, don't you? You're sure right, Roshan. And that's because of the physical power that you see from guys like Andrew Russell. The fact that uh, West Indies team in the T20 format, they have a high find the fielder oh my God. and he fumbles well 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 have not seen that yet from the goal gladiators goes straight and goes long one bounce into the boundary Russell on fire, end of the power playovers. It's 52 for one. Edged away, fortuitous boundary. It's raining boundaries in this innings. Colombo Kings on fire with the bat. Run of five balls is a brilliant return. Spoiled. Conceding a boundary. Goes high, goes long. Gets a good result. Colombo Kings continue to pile on the runs. Absolutely. Shiraz's last two was quite impressive. Goes again. And another six. Wow. Good support for Andre Russell. It's not Muhammad Ahmed Gibbs. Oh, nicely done. It's not all prone when it comes to Andre Russell. There are brains as well. 53 of what? 14 balls? In the single, he's got a plan against Shahid Afridi. Watch out! Oh. Oh. It's not boundary, man. Oh, I should have stopped. I should have stopped the boundary. Yes, he was taking his chances to catch that one, but can help them, can hold them in good stead. Clipped away. Goes over the boundary. Another six for Andrew Russell. He's making look, it look very easy. Contributed heavily with 65 to the total of 96. Brilliant. Gladiators did slightly better. They were going at 26 runs. They brought the average down. And it makes you think, why don't you just check him at the top of the order in 2020? It was 
swing. And he went with the swing. Couple of bounces, and that's gone for four. Or two to finish this over. Hit that well enough. That's gone for six. That's a very good shot. Beautifully played. Yeah, in the hunt. Four balls, 14. Required rate around 19. One. Man inside the circle, fine leg, and that's beautifully played. That's clever. That's really clever. That's a really good shot. One of one of Danushka's. The context: 26 runs scored off the first over. Clever again. It's got enough on it. Something they practice a lot these days. Is he going to come back for the second? Yes, he can do that quite comfortably. Oh, that's solid. That's a beautiful shot. Strong wrists. Pump that away for a boundary. That's a mile 11 circle champion shot. It's not easy to hit that length like that. Mm. Last ball, the second over. Oh, that's whipped away. Whipped away for six runs. That is a perfect way to finish over number two. So 16 runs off that over. 35 for no loss. Wasting time. Yeah. And he's picked up a wicket. That is an extraordinary over. That is magnificent stuff. It has just conceded two runs also has picked up a wicket. Oh, it was I who was harsh. Yes. <laughs> so again, there's going to be no pace. There's uh, no men back at third man or, or fine leg. Nice and full, squeezing it down through the third man region, and that's gone for four. That's a my 11 circle champion shot. He wants a new bat. On no Russell did early. Slaps that away. Has it got through? Yes, it has. Pick the gap. I told you, get it right. Concede four. You're still winning because you're saving your team too. Get winning. And that's another boundary. So 14 off that over. He's not happy for it. He's got a bit grumpy tonight. Wasn't happy with their fielding. He's, he's, he is a very, very fine bowler. Is it going to be out? Yes, it is out. Case Armand has picked him up. We're not going to see the flip at 11.15. Uh, Is it another? Is it another? Oh, Kesa Hamad. No, it isn't. It's actually another, but it's another six. Last ball. Still having a dip. What's he done to finish? He's picked up another big one. Six more runs. Couple of big sixes to finish. Well, that is outstanding work from Andre Russell. He is the star, that's for sure. And the Colombo Kings have got up again. They won the Super Over in game number one. They've now won this one in a five-over game. You won by 34 runs in a five-over game. Andre Russell has beaten the gold gladiators on his own and he's allowed to wear different colored shoes too well great job done by the colombo kings two wins in two one very tight so they're finding ways to win dominant in every way
Football gladiators, plenty to think about.